Good morning, everybody. Um, it is Wednesday, and today is the last day of the month of Sivan, which means tonight begins the month of Tammuz, which we'll start speaking about. I also want to talk a little bit about what Rosh Chodesh is all about, the beginning of the month, the power, ener- the power and the energy of the beginning of the month, but we'll talk about that hopefully tomorrow. So on this last day of Sivan, the last day of the month of Torah. What is the focus? What's the energy? What do we want to be concentrating on? And the answer to that, in my opinion, is very simple and straightforward. This is the, the, the power of the giving of the Torah, both the written Torah and the oral Torah that we've been discussing for the last several days, came, emanated from the sixth day of the month of Sivan and continues to reverberate until the very end of the month. So this is the last, the final moments of the month of Torah, of receiving the Torah. And just like we said when we were talking about Shavuos, Shavuos is not a commemoration of the events that took place at Mount Sinai. It is the connecting to and the tapping into and reliving the power and the energy of those events. So our connection to Torah for the year, the our, our ability to learn Torah, to find meaning and wisdom and depth in Torah, to internalize the Torah and to make it part of our lives in a meaningful way, to remember what we learn and to be able to apply what we learn, all of that comes from the, the emanation of Torah and the judgment that takes place every year during this month regarding our access and our um, and the impact that Torah is going to make on us. So my feeling is in these final moments of Sivan, it's a time to take advantage of the power of prayer and to turn to the Almighty, turn to Hashem, and say, Hashem, without your Torah, my life has no wisdom. My life has no meaning. My life has nothing to guide it. My life has no joy. My life has no purpose. Please, Hashem, Give me access to your Torah this year. Let Torah penetrate my mind. Let it penetrate my heart. Let it inform me. Let it guide me. Let the wisdom of the Torah, both the written Torah and the oral Torah, be a light, a a flashlight that shines for me and guides me and helps me to make the right decisions and the right choices. Let me feel the pleasure, the sweetness, the joy of learning Torah and teaching Torah to Anybody who wants to listen, it's my children, my grandchildren, my friends, my parents, and um, please God, let this let this month of Torah make an impact on our whole year. So that's what I think is uh, the opportunity of today. So take advantage of it, and um, tomorrow we'll start talking about Rosh Chodesh, and then we'll begin discussing the month of Tammuz. Have a great day, everybody.